Welcome to this Getting Started video that shows you how to use Maxwell Render with Form Z. First check that the Form Z plugin is correctly stored in your Form Z folder. This is inside the plugin's subfolder. Now you can open Form Z as usual. Follow the sample scene created for this tutorial. You can download it in Form Z format from our website. Open the scene to get started. It is a simple scene containing two cups on a table and some planes to be used as emitters. Position the cameras to get a close-up of the table. Ensure that your camera is aiming and focusing on the object. The focal length of the camera allows you to set the optics and the field of view. A lower value corresponds to a wide angle lens, while a higher value creates a tele lens effect, just like a real camera. Open the Display Options menu to get the Maxwell Options panel. Here you can find all the Maxwell settings, like output paths, rendering time, environment settings, etc. Set an output file format and path. Leave the environment type in Physical Sky and hit Maxwell Render from your display menu to export the scene to be rendered. This is the Maxwell Engine Core application. From here you can watch the render cleaning while the rendering process is taking place. You can stop the render manually whenever you want to, restart it and adjust the resolution. You can also adjust the ISO and shutter values to control the exposure of the image during the render interactively, or even after the render has finished. The preview window will display the changes interactively. They will be displayed periodically in the big window when each sampling level is reached. Look at the next SL countdown. The render will continue until the render time value or the sampling level SL value you set is reached. Of course you can manually stop rendering by hitting the stop button.
As you can see, it is easy to use Maxwell to render your scene with Form Z.